So I am Anita Sarkeesian. I run a nonprofit called Feminist Frequency. We look at the way women are represented in popular culture. Uh, we're, sp we're known mostly for our series called Tropes Versus Women in Video Games, looking specifically at some harmful representations of women in gaming. Uh, Just saying, yeah, there's a problem in the gaming community, and it is that they are misogynistic. And then they provided some sort of BS fluffy argument to attempt to back it up, which I think failed uh, tremendously. Your background is in academia. Sort well, of. Sort of? Yes. <laughs> um. Hi, my name is Anita Sarkeesian. I'm from Los Angeles, California, and my website is neonandchrome.com. And I just want to let you all know how amazing Alex's Teleseminar Secrets was. It really motivated me to get my own business started. Um, in my current day job, I saw how teleseminars could change the face of your business and make a lot of money, but I didn't really understand how it worked. And I'm only 23 and I've already started my own business promoting teleseminars for small businesses around me and it's really made a huge impact on my life. You know, often women who talk critically about media get accused of like not being a real geek girl or not being a real gamer or whatever that means. And the thing is, I came to this as a fan and as someone who loves gaming. And exactly a fandom. I'm not a fan of video games. I actually had to learn a lot about video games in the process of making them. You're not militantly trying to stop games being made. No. You're trying to start a dialogue of the yeah. creative processes and the our, thoughts. Our major Are you sure about that? Quote, the Australian unit of Target has pulled Grand Theft Auto V from its shelves after thousands of people signed a petition lamenting the game's horrific treatment of female characters.